Hey, I want to tell you a little bit about why goal setting is important and why it's important to live by a goal, but from a neuroscience perspective. I'm here at Red Rock Canyon just outside of Las Vegas. Place is awesome, like incredible climbs all over the place. And I was climbing with a couple of guys who are a lot better than me. And I had some lofty goals. There were some big climbs I wanted to get and make sure I pulled off. Now, if my focus was entirely on the goal and the end result, then my brain is gonna be fighting the whole time. I'm gonna be in this fight, flight, or freeze response from the amygdala to try and get to that goal because I feel like a failure if I don't do it. I didn't so reach the goal. I didn't climb the climb that I wanted to climb cleanly today, but I learned four or five different things that every time I learned them and I said to myself, hey, that's a new skill you just picked up. That's a great um, insight. That's something that really aligns well with, with my values and my mission, which is to get better every day when I train, to push myself, to enjoy the outdoors. All the things that I value, all the things that are important to me, if I could find successes along the way, it means I'm not just waiting for that goal attainment. If you just wait for the goal attainment, then you're not getting these little squirts of dopamines. And that's why people say it's the journey that's important. You gotta understand from the neuroscience perspective what's going on in your head, how to make that journey important. So little successes, finding something you do, even if you don't make it to the top, even if you don't climb that grade, but finding that you did something great, even if your book doesn't get published, just finding the fact that your writing got better. All these little things are what helps us live a really successful, happy, fulfilled life that we're able to take enjoyment even if we don't attain the goal. So set your goals high, set them lofty, work hard to get there, but along the way, find things to celebrate, find things to really be proud of and, and that align with your values and your mission, and that'll make the journey super fun no matter what happens at the end.